Thumbling, it's your boy Ink with another, another, um, food for thought, right? So we have the, um, I was talking about a commitment, right? And I was talking about overcommitment. So, um, I, I would, I made a video on overachiever and underachiever. And I have a, I, I've been, I've been thinking a lot about psychology. I've been thinking about a lot of people. I've been paying attention to shows more and I'm understanding the people more and, I feel like there's there's a class of people called over um com they have an over commitment so they need to commit they need to they make commitment they always need to have something to say I'm gonna do this I'm gonna do that I'm gonna do this I'm gonna do that and I feel I feel that it's a it's a catch too so if you, if you don't commit enough it leads to complete to complacence right so this weekend I had three days off right and I wanted to stream I wanted to stream I wanted to stream I wanted to stream Saturday, amazing, stream 10 hours, right, not a problem, Saturday, stream 4 hours, what happened, I got complacent, I got lazy, right, and although it is kind of a problem, it, it is not good, and when I do commit to creating content, when I do create, con uh, commit on making as much content as possible, then you have these, and I become tired and people are worried about me. So I feel like I, I, I've been working on this theory. I've been working on this. I've been trying to understand why is it like that? Why does commitment leads to sadness and not commitment leads to denial or complacence? Well, I think, again, I did a, a um, food for thought for um, people who need to be in relationship to be loved. And I feel like... I feel like some people are smarter than others. I feel like those smart people understand that if you don't commit, they're not going to do this. But my fear of overcommitting is if everything is a commitment, then it's not sincere. Right? Making a video because I can make a video is more sincere than committing to make a video a day. Because if you're committing to make a video a day, then you're committing to, to, to put a put out content you might not like. But just about the commitment. Right? So it's hard because you, you want to commit to things, but then... You, you know, you can say, I love you to somebody, right? And as crazy as it is, you're going to say, I love you to somebody else. And at first, I love you, it means nothing, right? It's, it's multiple commitments seem ungenuine. Uh, but no commitment seems like laziness. So again, there's this gray zone where do, do or don't, you're damned. And I'm trying to understand why committing is such an acceptable thing and now I'm committing you hear a lot of people have this fear of commitment fear of commitment right people are, are called you have a fear of commitment you have a fear of commitment people told me that already but there's not an expression for people who overcommit and it's as if people have this understanding that committing too much is better than not committing enough and I just don't know I just don't know guys food for thought Love you guys. Peace.